My name is Dr. No Limit. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I present to you part 5 on our series Why Contractors Fail. In this series, we are showing you the problem as a result of job done by unprofessional contractors. The internal leakage, rotting and soaked deck, causing a big problem for the rooms or the apartment underneath so we show you stages you need to follow to make sure that such program is avoided the first step is to make sure you remove all the rubbles use cement and sharp sand to prepare the floor make sure the edge is in a slope or curved way close all the possible water penetration with the cement and then when it dries you sweep it clean it make sure it's clean and then that is the first stage then you come to the second stage where you mix your water sealant this one you have a and b mix them properly and then make sure it's properly mixed so this is the third step in this service and then you apply it on the prepared floor that is well clean dry use your brush to apply it make sure you close all the possible penetration this is water sealant so it must be applied on the pores openings the tiny micro pores you must make sure you use the sealant to close it because what you want to avoid is water moving from this floor down to the underneath rooms and cause problem on the deck so you must make sure you prepare the wall and then use this sealant to cover everywhere sometimes you will cover the walls too so that opposite side of the wall will maintain the paint otherwise the paint will also have problem make sure you help us to subscribe and then give us thumb up this is a way of helping us so sometimes you pour it on the floor and then to have Avoid wasting time and then use your brush to spread it. Spread it um, well to make sure that it's covered or the possible penis water penetration is sealed. That is what you want to achieve to make sure you seal every possibility of water penetrating from this floor. You know, sometimes the tile that you're going to make the, the the joint the water can easily go through the joint especially when the grout is weak so that's why you must make sure you prepare the floor very very well before you lay your ties through the joint nothing can stop the water from going in except what you are doing in this video so Take your time and watch to the end. After you've finished this stage of applying the first um, water sealant, then you go to the next stage. And that is the stage four. So in this stage, you apply the bitumen, which is hydrocarbon product you use it to seal the possible places that the first compound could not so you use this one just to ensure that the work is guaranteed that's what we do and that's what i'm showing you if you take this method as we've presented here you will not have problem 
So when you prepare it, then you test it. This is where the contractors miss it by not testing it with water. Allow it to stay there for 24 hours and confirm that it's okay. Hello, my name is Dr. No Limit. I just want to thank you for taking your time to watch this video till this time. It means you find it interesting. And I want to ask you, please, don't end until you leave a comment at the comment section. I want to know how you feel. Please, I also want to ask you that you may consider subscribing for my YouTube channel if you have not done so. Please, thank you for considering to do it now. Thank you. Thank you.